Today I made Frisco Melt Sloppy Joes on garlic bread. I'm obsessed with Steak and Shake's Frisco Melt. I thought this would be a fun version to make at home. So first I did the sauce for it. I did about three-fourths cup of Thousand Island dressing, a half cup of French dressing, and then a dash of Worcestershire sauce and a few tablespoons of ketchup. You're just gonna stir that up really well and then cook your meat. So I did a pound of ground beef, threw in an onion in there, and then I added some burger seasoning. So you're just gonna stir that up in there. And then I did about a fourth cup of beef broth. And then you're gonna put a little more Worcestershire sauce right here. And then a tablespoon of cornstarch. Then you're gonna get your sauce that you made and put about a half cup in there of that. You can put more of that sauce in there if you want, if you want it more sloppy for your sloppy joe, or you can do less, whatever you want. And then I baked the Texas toast style uh, garlic bread. I just do it as the package says. And then you're gonna layer your cheese and your meat on. First I did a slice of American cheese and then I put my meat mixture down and then I did a slice of Swiss cheese. I only had enough for six, just so you know. So add more ground beef if you want all eight done. Then you're gonna put those back in the oven for another four minutes or so. But these turned out so delicious. I ate three instantly.